I remembered something against my will today. After I saw this video by Deanna Na, I'll tag it below, about this caterpillar doing caterpillar stuff. And I abruptly recalled that they taught us all that caterpillars just turned into soup inside their cocoons. And I was like, is that actually right though? And it turns out not really. This is from askentomologist.com, so they're legit. It's complicated. No, the insect doesn't turn into goo. Most important structures stay intact. Basically what happens, it goes in the cocoon because what's about to happen is very private. It starts to dissolve the parts of its body that it's not gonna use when it's a butterfly. That's the best way to describe it. But the parts it is going to use when it becomes a butterfly still exist. They have existed since it was a caterpillar. Not completely. There's not like a wing inside the caterpillar. They're like seeds maybe for the parts that are going to grow. So it's dissolving the parts that it doesn't need and then it uses that as fuel to grow the parts it does. So it doesn't dissolve completely into soup and then somehow magically become a beautiful butterfly. It dissolves the parts that are not butterfly and grows the parts that are butterfly that always existed in the caterpillar. Does that make sense? They're called imaginal disc. It grows one for every adult body part when it's a caterpillar. So when the caterpillar is in the egg, it has all of these and nothing new is happening in the cocoon. They're just growing the butterfly parts. And I also learned they trained caterpillars to react to a certain scent and then the butterfly that they turned into reacted to the scent also. So they technically have memories from when they were a caterpillar, which is crazy. Anyway, I thought it was interesting.